Well guys, my name is Larry and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to put you a, a video together at the request of a bunch of other people out there in YouTube land about my old water well drilling machine. I uh, actually built this thing, oh god, I guess it's been four years, maybe longer. And I drilled 18, 20 holes, I guess. Uh, the deepest I went at this point was 200 foot because that's all the drill pipe I have and I made the drill pipe myself. I just bought the, the collars for the end. And I welded them on some heavy thick wall pipe. The old machine is all home built. So it's nothing fancy, nothing fast, but it'll drill a hole. This video is only going to show the basic setup of it today. I drilled down eight foot while ago just to test the machine because it's been sitting in mothball for about a year and a half, two years, and we have not ran it. So needless to say, I had to clean the carburetor out on the water pump and the the hydraulic drive motor repair and uh, get it all set up that was the reason I just wanted to test it with eight foot of pipe I'd also like to mention I apologize for the background noise of the dogs but uh, the neighbors dogs can't do nothing with them got a 275 gallon tote there that we're storing our water in we had one full tote earlier but it didn't last long you see them clumps in that ground over there the bottom of these pits cracked up pretty good, so we lost about 200 something gallons of water right away. Now that all fills in with the sediment, you know, once you start drilling. And right now we're running through eight foot of clay. So once we continue with the video, we shouldn't have any water problems. Everything should be all right. Nothing but a little old bitty trash pump. Let's see if we get a picture of that. The old Derrick folds over when I want to haul it down the highway. Hydraulic cylinder there to go up and down with. Hydraulic drive pump right there. Filter mounted on the side of the tank. This is the, the bit we're going to clean out with. It's six and seven eighths, which will put you about a nine inch hole by the time it wobbles itself all the way down to the bottom of the hole. All the drill pipe, like I said earlier, I made myself. Thick wall pipe, collars that I bought, and uh, welded them on it. My controls are nothing more than a dual stick hydraulic controller right here. One to spin, one to go up and down. And a bungee cord to keep it automatic when I don't want to stand there and hold on to it. The bit that we're starting out with is this one down here. I think it's about four and seven eighths inch or something like that. That's my starter bit, pilot bit, I guess you'd call it. This is the other end of the drill, drill pipe. There's my little plate that I made to uh, break the collars loose. Well, guys, stay tuned. I'll, I'll get you the rest of this video and put out another part. It's just hard for me to upload a, a long video. We have really, really slow internet. We're way out here in the country. And our internet's not the best in the world, so we'll probably have to make this a two-part video, maybe even a three-part video. So make sure you hit the like subscribe button if you want to see our future videos when one of, one of those new ones comes out. We'll notify you right away to we'll continue with the water well drilling process. The next part, like I said, will be actually drilling in the ground, watching the water flow, seeing what comes out the hole, and uh, letting you see what this machine will actually do. Again, it's nothing but old homemade machine, so don't, ex don't expect anything spectacular, but it gets the job done. Stay tuned for part two.